This is how you can lose weight without exercising. But who am I to tell you anything? I went from this to this and I've been gaining muscle and losing weight over the past five years quite successfully. I'm not here to preach anything to you. I'm just here to give you my life experience so you can pick and choose what you want to add into your own life. So a lot of people associate diet and exercise to be one and the same. If you're exercising, then you must be eating clean. If you're eating clean, then you must be exercising. You can't have a healthy lifestyle without one or the other. You have to do both. This is flat out wrong. Now, it's amazing if you do both, but if you're starting, you can just start with one. Personally, I started by working out and then I got my diet in check, but other people get their diet in check and then they start working out. Now to lose weight without exercising, all you need is a calorie deficit. Now you can either get that from moving more or you can eat less. So we're going to be covering the eating less portion within this video. If you don't do any exercise and you want to lose weight, put yourself in a calorie deficit. How do we exactly do this? Well, you need to know what your maintenance calories are. If you press the first link in the description, we have a free calorie calculator. Or if you don't want to use that, just search up on Google calorie calculator free and you should be able to find your maintenance. Once you find that, use the notes app or any calorie tracking app to track your food and eat 300 to 500 calories below your maintenance calories. That should allow you to lose around one pound per week without doing any type of exercise. If you just eat less food, you will lose the weight. Now, if you're not really about that and that seems tedious, I also got you. What you can do is just try to cut back on the things that you intuitively know aren't healthy for you. So I started my diet actually by not tracking calories at all. I just took out sugar from my coffee and then slowly I started eating less and less candy. Once I took out all sweets from my diet, I was probably in a solid 500 calorie deficit and I lost a decent amount of weight from literally doing almost nothing. So find something like that in your life, whether you're adding unnecessary sugar to coffee or tea, or you catch yourself for some reason eating sugar with like a spoon out of the tub. I don't really know what goes on at your house, but you know, I'm not going to judge. So try to remove that and just try to add in more high volume, healthier foods, such as more vegetables and more lean meats like chicken, some lean beef, maybe some tuna, and you should be gold. Now let's cover exercise just a little bit. You don't actually have to go to the gym to lose weight. That's absolute nonsense. If you just have decent daily activity, like you have an active job, you walk 10,000 steps per day, that's enough for any type of cardio that you will ever need for weight loss. I honestly don't even recommend that people do cardio if they walk more than 10,000 steps per day. Anything above that is just a cherry on top and it might actually be deleterious to you. If you can slightly increase your physical activity, that will supplement for a lot of the help that exercise will give you. So I know it's regurgitated a lot, but maybe park away from work a little bit further, get in some extra steps, maybe go on more walks. Anything that comes to mind just to get yourself moving a little bit more will help you out tremendously. And the last thing I want to cover is why exercise is important for weight loss. You don't need to exercise to lose weight whatsoever. Weight loss is just an energy balance. If you have less energy, you will lose the weight. If you have more, you will gain it. But what strength training primarily does, which is what you do in the gym or when you do calisthenics or other bodyweight exercises, is it allows you to build and retain muscle. If you ever put yourself in a caloric deficit, your muscle starts atrophying. They will get smaller. And a lot of people come to realize that when they lose a lot of weight, that they just look skinny fat because they never built a muscular frame behind there. So I'd recommend to hit the gym at least three times a week. And if you don't want to do that, you can do bodyweight exercises. This is how I started. And I built a pretty decent physique by just doing exercises at home. I had one set of dumbbells and I made it work. So I'm definitely confident that you can make it work as well. It only took me about 30 minutes per day. If you have no idea where to start with your diet, press the first link in the description. We will calculate your maintenance calories and make you a completely free diet plan almost instantly. If I shared anything of value, please consider subscribing. It'd help us out a lot. And don't forget to stay savvy with your diet.